Hey, this is Suzanne Mosley with Esporn Books and More. You can find me online at SuzanneSharesEsporn.com. Wanted to show you one of my family's all-time favorite Esporn books. Seriously, we've had this mm, for five years now. <laughs> and see what great shape it's still in. Uh, but it's called uh, the Esporn Time Traveler book. And this is a combined volume of four different books, um, uh, four different um, time periods in ancient history. Um, the Medieval Times, Viking Age, Roman World, and Ancient Egypt. And my boys love this book. They will not stop reading it, uh, which isn't that every parent's dream. Um, as a parent, what I love is that it takes these hard to um, visualize and conceptualize um, time periods from the past, like ancient Egypt, which is so foreign and unfathomable to our children today, and it puts them in a fun narrative story, and um, it allows them to see what daily life was like in those ancient times. Um, and it does that through um, the story of a family featured in that time period. So let's look at the, um, the Vikings here. This is the Viking time period. So it shows um, the little boy putting on his time travel machine, and it kind of tells the story. It shows where he's going, and then poof, he gets there thanks to his time travel machine. And so that's the first page of the Viking, um, the Viking Raiders. Okay, and then next it shows the Viking family that he's going to meet on the way, and it introduces um, the whole family. So this is Newt and his family, Newt, Astrid. Hafton, uh, he's 20 year, 22 years old. He's the eldest son. Sven, Bjorn. Um, so it, it, it tells uh, all the family members of Newt's family. And then the following pages, it, it gives you um, a narrative description of what the Vikings uh, did, what they, um, how they raided, um, how they um, cooked their food, the homes they lived in. So this this um, picture here is about the farm and how a, a home and a farm would have been set up uh, for the Vikings. Then it shows inside their home and it gives tons of description um, about that. It shows their Viking warship. It shows them going on a raid and how the Vikings raided and, and what all um, happened with that. Well, I'm losing my book. Um, then it takes Finn on a little journey. And anyway, it follows this family throughout the entire book. And then that's the end of, it, of the Vikings, and then it moves on to ancient Rome. So it takes a lot of information that would be dull and dry and boring and puts it into story uh, form. And your child will love following Newt and his family and seeing what all happens with the Vikings and the other families in ancient Egypt and the medieval times and um, in the Roman world. So it's a fabulous, again, fabulous nonfiction title um, put to life that um, will get your child excited about history and excited about um, these ancient civilizations that, um, that will be hard for them to understand. So it's a great, uh, it can be used as a read aloud. That's what our family um, has done with it um, multiple times. So again, Usborn Time Traveler, love it, love it, love it. Uh, it's great for homeschooling, great for a homework helper, just a resource to have in your family's library. So if you would like a copy, you can get one at SuzanneSharesUsborn.com. Thanks. Bye.